All right, this is a baby bedding set. And it is from Stork and Style Modern Nursery Crib Set. This is a navy blue set. And I was going to take the whole thing out and show you, but every time I start pulling pieces out, my eyes start watering and I start coughing. So these are going to need to be washed before they're used if you buy it for yourself. Now it comes in a great plastic little bag. It even has a carry handle. So you can easily put things back in here as you don't need them. Or use it to store other bedding supplies. Um, out of season or grow into clothing. Uh, very useful bag. You don't have to throw it away. Um, so I'm going to show you these as best I can. This is a, most of it's polyester. Uh, some feels like cotton and some of it feels real silky. So this is a more cotton feel and I think this is a quilt. Um, as you can see, it's uh, really, yeah, that's a baby blanket. This isn't the quilt. This is the baby blanket. And the inside, the inside's dark blue. The stitching all looks really good. And if it weren't for some of these pieces have a very chemical smell, I'd pull these out and let you see them really nicely. Uh, maybe my sister will help me with that later. Then you've got this quilt, which has a really interesting pattern, a uh, real geometric, again, navy blue. This is a smaller one, but you can see this one wraps around and around and around and finally stops right about here where it doubles back. So you get two huge blankets. This one's really thick, thin. This one's really thick. I won't say this is really thin. It has half as much microfiber as this one feels like. Um, okay, now my hands are itching. Um, this is a crib sheet. You can see the nice pokey dots. Um, I have had this out, and that's when I realized I just really cannot handle the smells. This has a lot of polka dots here, and uh, once I get this washed, it will be fine, but um, definitely going to have to wash this. I'm allergic to sizing, which is probably what's on here. It helps keep it nice and flat and wrinkle-free. So this is a crib sheet, and there's also a changing pad cover. Uh, nice elastic. I did check out the elastic. I was looking for a tag, so I was looking for the smallest pieces. They are made in China. And they are polyester. Uh, then you've got a dark blue here, which is a diaper stacker. <clears throat> and you can look at the pictures. Not that part. This part. This part is a diaper stacker. I can feel it stiff. So it should hold its shape well as, the, uh, as you begin to run out of diapers. And there's also a crib skirt in there somewhere that uh, hangs down and it should be navy blue. And overall, I would say this is a really nice set. $100, $110 for it. I don't know. Uh, my sister tells me I'm a bit of a, a cheapskate and that I don't know the, va the modern value because my kids were, I mean, my youngest is over 10. My oldest is approaching 30. And I would never have dreamed of spending $100 for a baby bed set. I'm the one who goes to the garage sales and finds a set that people have just outgrown and buy it for, you know, 20 bucks. But if new is what you want and this is the style you want, just know when you bring it out, don't you dare put a newborn on this wash all the pieces in fact I'd wash them two or three times to make sure all the sizing is out uh, avoid using a high chemical laundry soap you never know what's going to enter ir irritate a newborn skin all right folks um, <clears throat> this is what you get it's just really simple well packaged and um, 
I was really impressed actually with with it as a whole and uh, I think I think it's really nice uh, other than the chemical smell